I have an update on the attack of Bishop Mari Mari Emmanuel, who was doing a live stream in Sydney, Australia at his church before he was attacked on live stream by a 15 year old radical Islamic extremist. Uh, this is the picture of the kid right after he tried to stab and kill this man, smiling and shouting Allah Akbar. Four five members of the congregation scream as a man stabs the priest several times in the head and chest. The video shows a separate eyewitness video verified by Reuters and taken into the aftermath of the incident shows the man being pinned to the ground by several others, his face obscured. A voice speaks in Arabic and says, if they didn't insult my prophet, I wouldn't have come here. If they didn't involve himself in my religion, I would not come here. I'm going to show you the video of just how the attack happened. So warning, this part is crazy. <laughs> Horrible. You see, in John 16, verse 2, it says that for you will be expelled from the synagogues, and the time is coming when those who kill you will think that they are doing a holy service for God, just like this idiot thought he was going to do. But for those of you who call Islam a peaceful religion, you don't understand just how much hatred they have towards true Christianity. The devil hates Christianity. The devil hates believers in Christ. And Jesus said this in Matthew 24, verse 9. He says, then you'll be handed over to be persecuted and put to death. And you will be hated by all nations because of me. Our God is an amazing and faithful God. He protected this man because the knife fully couldn't penetrate his skull. And something malfunctioned with the knife. And he is in stable condition. All glory and honor to Jesus Christ. We'll turn to the Lord Jesus Christ, man. All these religions that hate God that hate christians they're proving it time and time again and you wave their flags and you protect these people and you don't understand that they absolutely hate you if you are a believer in christ so let's continue to raise him up in prayer and i can't wait for him to testify of the glory and the power of god through this testimony god bless you guys